What's up guys, welcome back. We're here with another episode of our EU4 campaign as the Byzantine Empire. Um, and I'd just like off to start off with saying I'm sorry for the lack of uploads recently. I've been moving into my new house at university and that's taken up a bit of time. But um, So yeah, I apologise for that. But we are now back with more EU4 and I hope you're enjoying the uh, episode. The last episode got a lot of support and uh, I'd just like to thank you all for that. And if you're enjoying the series, please continue to show your support for it. And uh, hopefully in the next few episodes we can take the Roman Empire and yeah, we'll uh, have a complete campaign. So anyway, we'll just, oh, and just like that everyone joins a, co a coalition against us. Excellent. So um, yeah, we may have a little bit of a, a lull in expansion for a moment as like the, all of Western Europe just goes, no, you can't do that. You can't do that. Oh, someone's left coalition? People are le coming and going very quickly. Um, okay, this jet, this army lost a general. Let's just put him in charge. And they entered a coalition. Oh, a lot of people are entering coalitions all of a sudden. <laughs> um, okay, and then we'll just build some improvements, I guess. Um, build a bit. Build a better trade routes. Why not? Um, church? No, you're not really worth it. Regimental camp? Not really worth it. Army, eh, why not? <laughs> um, okay, so let's see who's in this coalition against us then. That's very scary. Oh, just about everyone, so we'll, we'll hang around. Yep, the land just entered. Well, that kind of leaves no one to expand into. Venice, possibly? Oh, not in the coalition, but we've just got a truce with them. I'm sure as soon as the truce ends, they'll join that coalition. So, anyway, what do we need? required left to form the Roman Empire. We still need Fez, York, Cairo, oh gosh, we need quite a bit. We need all of Italy, France, Iberia, the Balkans, Anatolia, and the Mashariq region. Okay, so, Vienna would be an obvious next target. It's right there on the door. So I'm gonna, I think I've got Cassius Belli's against them. Yes, okay. And we could actually go to war with them now. I might. Since they're not in the coalition, we'll do it. Who can we call in? Malaysia would come in. Yep, yeah, sure, why not? My loyal ally they've been all this time. Um, and then, yeah, let's do that. I want to get one that's basically diplomatic ideas, which brings down um, aggressive expansion. Ah, and here we go. This one, espionage ideas. Um, yes, I don't care about... I'd rather keep stability. So we've got espionage ideas now. Um... And our first diplomatic one, so that's perfect. Let's just take Vienna. Uh, we could possibly, and Ulm's entered. Uh, just get out, all you people. We, no one cares. All right, Vienna's taken. This is a very weak Austria. I've just realised they've not had a fun time of it. Um, great advisor has died. That's a shame. That's the diplomatic one. Well, we'll just put spy networks in. Um, so yeah, we'll do this quickly. Have a look. Take Linz. I mean, I think I'm going to take it for Salzburg. Yeah, I have a feeling. Oh, and Genoa's. Oh, Genoa's having not 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 Genoa. Is it Genoa? Who's this? Oh my gosh. Yeah, Genoa's got a rebellion going on, and they're coming through my lands. Uh, Hungary wants peace. I will accept. Their peace because I don't really want their lands. Oh, Brandenburg joined. Okay, yeah, of course. All these other nations have joined because I'm at war with um, the Holy Roman Emperor, of course. I should have realized that. Oh, well, that's a silly move. Oh, poor Wallachia, they're just going to die. Oh, well. And now we just kill these guys off. He says he's not quite sure. Oh, gosh, that was close. That was very, very close. Um, Norwegian infantry, excellent. That's the next, like, best infantry up. Um, do I want to do? Yeah, we're well ahead, so we can do an idea. We can afford one. Um, Sadoltai infantry we've got reformed, and we've got all them. Okay, excellent. And the Battle of Ravensburg's done. Um, Alas has been taken. 
And then we'll just go and take that other fort up here. And just go and watch as we destroy everyone. Uh, who else is still in this? Nassau, Nuremberg. Nuremberg's just there. Let's go and take that. Okay, our cells might drop out in a minute. Here they go. Yep, uh, we'll give cause. Yeah, sure, I don't really care about like what happens. You just. Oh my gosh. Oh yes, we still have our Empress in charge. She's been in since like two episodes ago. And Franz have entered a coalition. Okay, well, I assumed you were in it anyway, Franz, to be honest. Um, Austria. No, I'm not. Um, yeah, you can break up on that. Oh my gosh, sorry, there's so many pop ups at the moment. Because the Crimean flipping doing something. Um, um, I'll go military. Crimean's doing something. What are they doing? I don't know. Anyway, go back there. Right, and then you are free to go elsewhere. Brandenburg, go and take your lands, I guess. Where are you? Hanging out. Berlin's your main spot. Do you know it's just got claiming everything in my land and it's annoying because it's popping up and it's very infuriating. Right. We've got so much money now, it's just ridiculous. Um just build all these. Keep building. Berlin's fallen. Um yep, yeah, you can do that, that's fine. Brandenburg. Who's left in this war then? Nassau and Saxon Lornberg. Well, Saxon Lundberg's there. Oh, did they just try and raise troops up? Oh, that's that's funny. Um, no. What would you give me now? And I want Vienna. I want Vienna. La Lundberg and Vienna could be taken. Oh, uh, not Lundberg. Um, yeah, I'll take that. Um, okay. You give me that. And you okay, actually, they they let me annex Austria. Um, well, no, I will annex Austria. It's kind of annoying. Yeah, you've been annexed. Okay, annexed. Lovely. Yeah, and obviously people are going to join a coalition now. And it's probably going to kick a war off, but... I don't care. I'm strong enough to beat you all now. There's one less... That's one less uh, region that we need to take, I'm pretty sure, now. We now have Vienna. We need Fez. Where the hell's Fez? Isn't Fez down here somewhere? Okay, you joined the... Okay, people are joining coalitions. That's fine. You don't need to know. And Hamburg's joined. I'm pretty sure there's no one left in the world that hasn't joined. Fez is here. Okay, so Portugal's got it. So we've got to do more wars in North Africa at some point, which is n not fun, because I don't really like fighting in North Africa. Um, personally, but yeah. Um, I'm going to build a big old fort here in Avignon on the nice western border because that should be a, a stronghold to hold, basically. Um, has Vienna got a fort? Yes, it does still. Vienna, I'm going to upgrade your fort. Um, actually, I can't. I can't turn, so we'll do yours, though. Let's start upgrading some forts just for defensive reasons. So it takes them even longer to get through. Cairo... Yep, you can have it for... don't think you need to go further south than Cairo right now, so that's fine. Um, we'll build another strong one here in Treviso and another strong one here in Mantua. So they can't get through any of these regions now. Which is perfect. No one likes me enough want to have an alliance with me. Because everyone's at a coalition. Um, but yeah, look at us now. We're looking pretty good. The Empress has done a good job. She's taking a lot of land for the Empire in her lifetime. She, everyone else around her has got a, a lot to live up to. We'll put it like that. Um, okay, everyone's entering coalitions. I thought everyone was in it, to be honest, by this point. If you hadn't joined by now, you're just kind of a bit of a, a loser. Everyone wants to get involved in this war, clearly, when it happens. Uh, because, and when to prepare for that, we're just going to build a load of barracks, literally everywhere. And Poland, oh, Poland is one of the only people in the world that still like me enough. I want a royal marriage. Um, they won't do anything like that yet. And they're having internal problems. Um, and they got, oh my gosh, they've sw uh, swarmed in, I was going to try and say, but I failed there. Um, swarm in and try and take uh, Hungary, they did. Didn't realise I helped them out so much. They've taken so much land. Well, they should might be next on their list. And that's not on. Um, anyway, I'm going to annex... Not annex. I'm going to 
claim some bits of land. Okay, thank you. You've all become loyal subjects. Um, Rashid, I'd like to take. I'd like to take Benghazi down the other side. Wherever it is, Benghazi's there. What else can I take? What else can I take? Dana? Yeah, sure, we'll take that. That should be enough claims for now. Um, and we'll convert some places while we're here. Um, Army tradition can go down for a little bit. I can afford it. Um, and Monfret, are you in the coalition? Yes, I think everyone's in the coalition by now. Yep, Venice finally joined. Salzburg are definitely in it. Hungary are the only ones not in it, I think, on my entire border. And uh, they're mad not for being it, to be honest. Um, it's just a bit mad. Um, okay, the Sunny Zealots could be rising up in a minute. Oh, my advisor died again. Oh, a different one died. Okay, that's fine. Um, improve. Yep, cool. Can you please go home? Yep, I don't care. Just get, put him in here. I don't really want him still in Byzantium, Crimea. Even though it's very key to us, it's not my main my main aim to hold on to this. Oh, we could put a better fort here in Crimea. We could build one there as well, actually. Just to keep Crimea very nice and tight. So it doesn't even require any armies there because there's going to be so many forts. Um, and what can I spend money on? I could probably just put some, take some people out of debt if I wanted to. Um, I'll spend it all on manufactories, which I don't need to. I have too much money, some would say. Too much money. Um, and yep, you claim Alexandria. Uh, so I need to get some clay. Oh, well, Portugal aren't in the coalition. Do some converting against them because uh, I don't know. As I say do some against them, but I'm not really actually going to take any land. Yep, thought they'd be in the coalition. Oh, we've lost colonial claims against. Well, I don't know. I'm confused. Oh, Tifala also a in this war. Uh, I'll stop converting on the Mamluks for now because that's kind of not really doing much. I can declare war and just take their land, take their capital, and then I get very close to, I might do that in a minute, um, what does this do, Mi missionary strength and economics are nearly close to being done, um, now I'm going to do diplomats, get another diplomat on the go, that will be excellent, uh, and my advisor keeps dying, they're just too old, too old and not cut out for the job. Um, let's look, what else can we get done? We need cooler diet, demand that, um, seek some of that, lovely, and then we'll grant some of that, and demand some of that, lovely. And now we're at war with Armenia, excellent. I need to break this alliance with the Emirati at some point, because they are just dragging me into wars I don't want to be in anymore. Oh, I can take this land from Armenia, myself. Oh! And just like that, we're in a war. We're in a big war. Okay. Uh, let's pause it for a moment. Let's see what wars we're in. Oh, God. Good God. I'm going to try and wipe pieces out so quickly. Um, <laughs> oh, God. Here we go. I expected nothing less. Um, how am I going to do this, then? With great skill and tact, I guess. Um, are you in the war? Yes, they are. So let's try and knock these guys out. Uh, recall. So I don't know if you're in the war, though, as well. Yep. Every, all my allies get called in, at least. At least, he says. Where the heck are all these guys? Right, so we've got big armies out here. I'm going to need to build my um, armies to 20 stack, uh, 30 stacks, I think, at some point, because we're running out of troops. Um, I'm going to just, I'm pausing, sorry, quickly a lot now, because this is a big war. Um, I'd like these claims. I don't know if Emreti will give them to me. That's the only problem. Um, we'll bring this army um, to the 
Um, I don't want to fight rebels either. Certs come under Tunis's control. Oh! There's a lot of lag. Something happened big. Maybe a big battle just happened somewhere. I'm not sure. Um, will Tunis go down here and kill them? Oh my goodness, Austria's just got overwhelmed with troops. I don't think even I can stop these uh, armies. I could be wrong. Oh no, we just beat, just beat them. Let's go in there and take Monferret. Okay, Monferret's been taken. Take Navarre. Navarre's been taken, you're the finest. Excellent. Is Milan, Milan's in the war, so just kill Milan. Oh, well, not Milan, but Venice is in the war. Kill Milan. Kill them all. Kill them all. Um, let's go over here. You come over here. We'll have a huge big war here. Oh dear, yeah, no wonder we're not winning this war because Poland's just getting overwhelmed. So let's just try and kill them all before Poland gets killed. Uh, you go back to Mantua. Let's go in here. And you've forgotten the icon, I see. Well, that's rude of you. We'll sort that out in a minute. Administrative. Um, remember your icons, please. It's St. Michael. He's uh, a good guy. And he uh, really likes you. So, there. Right. And you go into... You go into here. Oh, actually, no, don't go into there. That's just a... That's a pit of destruction going on there. Um, I did actually need to go and take those. Oh, well. Austria's in a military line. Austria's still alive? Where? Oh, there's some to go. Of course, no wonder they were happy with me to take all the land then. They still had one bit of land left. Um, go to Cremona. We're just going to... Italy is the place to defend. Italy, everyone comes to. Okay, kill these guys. And then, oh gosh, the lag because it's going into a huge battle and there's so many troops in a small area. Netherlands declares independence. Excellent. So Netherlands is now going to occupy the Brits because the Brits, for some reason, had the Netherlands. I didn't even look to see that. What the heck is going on over there? Um, 55,000 troops go that way. Take Piedmont from Milan. They can't be trusted with it. Um, go and take Lyon. I'll annoy the French. Um, go and take Lyons. Oh, actually, I should probably go and take Vienna. Save Vienna. Save Vienna. Vienna is actually kind of going to get taken. Excellent, right. Leon's been taken as well. Ah, oh, I'm not. I'm in an okay position now. I was a bit worried, but now that, that third army arrived, that is perfect. We've got this under control. Take, keep converting while you're here. Um, and obviously, that's the. F this is the fun bit of it. Being over, a bit overpowered, you just uh, go around stack wiping. Um, you go and take Milan. I'd like you to uh, Savoy in the war. Yes, they are. Let's just go and take their land then. That will annoy them. Well, I, look at all these nations that are in the war, and it's expecting me to beat all of these, and I will. I will prove them that I can. I don't even think I really want to take much land from this. I don't know. I could do with some land, but we'll see. We'll see what the suggested offers in a minute. Um, okay, we're going to need one of those armies back because here come the hordes again. The hordes have re-arrived. Let's go in, save their asses. Alright, we've done that. Let's go into Burgundy's. Burgundy is still alive as a nation. That's pretty impressive at this time. Actually, it's only 1500. It's, it's, it's doable. They hold on. Are you not in the war then? Is the Swiss in the war? I presume the Swiss are in the war. Yep. The Swiss are in the war. And Bern's been taken. Excellent. Alright, let's go and take that place. So it'll annoy even more people trying to attack me. Xerix. Nice. Um, I presume Salzburg's in the war. Siege. Oh, okay. Someone they took. They've taken Azov all the way out there. Well, good on them. Venice is going to take their land. Um, okay, there's an army here. Go and take that out. And Tyrol's fallen. Yeah, they, they've just taken something out there. Oh dear. It's taken them a long time to take anything. Are you in the war? Yep. Okay, well, you die next. Um, you come back to Navarre. 
Yeah, sorry, um, it's very micro heavy at the moment, so <laughs> I'm not really able to do a lot of talk. But I hope you guys are having great days. I think school, certainly school in the UK has started up again. And um, I presume like in other parts of the world it has. So, I mean, I hope everyone watching either at work or at school is uh, enjoying themselves. Uh, it's not being too hard on them. Um, oh my gosh, like not being too hard on them like Poland's having a hard time. Jesus, that's a lot of people. I might, for the sake of Poland, just end this war. What can I get? I can't get anything. Did I not, have I not won enough battles? Why can I not end it then? Why is this? I don't know. Maybe because I've not knocked enough people out. I don't really know. Oh well, yeah. Maybe as soon as I knock, um, thingy majiggy out. Um, well, they knock uh, thingy majiggy. That doesn't help you guys. Poland out. They'll uh, end the war. Because we're like, well, this isn't really worth it anymore. Where's my other army? Oh, it's there. I kind of want you back over here, please. Uh, Navarre. And I'd like you here. Khalid's. That's a big battle that we should win. Okay, done. Won it. Um, go down and take Narbon, please. And then go and take Provence. Lovely. I might march from Paris like, because I can. March from Paris. Brazilian fell. Oh no, this guy's just lost his general. No. Well, there you go. Have another one. Um, the Bard can be taken. Where else is... They're just trying to retake all the places that I've just taken as well. <laughs> They're like, quickly, no, man the guns, get to the, the breaches. Oh, okay, Paris fell. That was quick. I guess it's a one-star fort. Yeah, not a surprise. They never they never upgrade their... The AI never upgrades their forts. Like their capitals to make them, like, give them some forts. And that would really help them if they did. Let's just take Burgundy's fort. Wars of religion now have started in France, so they're going to have fun with them. Um... We've finally taken some random land down here. Oh, well, they just got kicked out of the war as well. I thought I even had an army down here. I'm not even really defending with it. Anywhere. Oh, good God. Poland's out of the war. I think I... Yeah, now I could probably... Probably uh, end it. I could demand some stuff. Oh, we could uh, demand a fair amount. I'm going to do it. I'm going to end it. There we go. End that war very nicely. Don't really know what I've gained. If anything. I gain a bit, two bits of land, that's fine. Rosetta. Um, so you just stay here, you go there. I'm going to keep three armies here. I'm gonna, I can afford to build a f another one. Um, how much are we making? Yeah, enough to make 10 million more armies. Um, no, just get rid of it, a bit of innovation. Let's build another one in Constantinople. Because that's where we build all our boys now. All of our armies. Right. Two more cav. Four more infantry here. Um, build on the other side of the aisle. No, actually that takes too long. Uh, cannons just take so long to produce. 100 days. Look at that. 105 days. Infantry here. Lovely. And who? Our oh, Armenians are end of the war. Did they give me anything? No. Of course not. I have to go to war with the Emirati at some point and just kill them off. And that means I lose another loyal ally. And they'll be like, what did we do? And they're like, you just existed because my goddamn missions tell me I've got to kill you at some point. It's sad and I don't want to do it. Right. I think I'm at a truce now with all of Europe. I don't want to look at this. Give me, give me that. Give me that. Yeah, look at that. All of Europe in a truce. Standardization of calibre, though. So we've got better cannons. So we'll... No, not that one. Cannons. Chambered demi cannons. Yep, that's it. Um, and we have a new emperor. Bizarre. Uh, training fields. Well, we'll spend all our money here. Now we have probably a lot of manpower. Good God. Look at all this. Uh, he died in Jofra. Okay. Keep spending the money. Right. Jofra. Where the heck's Jofra? Over here? No. Where's Jofra? I presume it's this guy. 
No, I don't know then. Well, you will go conversion to an army. Yeah, I'm not really sure what that is on about then. Oh well. Doesn't really matter. Um, we'll gather up. 24, we can build this to a 30. Um, yeah, we'll help them out. I'm glad I had enough money because otherwise they could have sent me bankrupt. I thought I didn't even have that much money. So just spend it all on, um, on training camps. I was like, oh, I don't know if I have that much. Um, oh, but look at us. We're looking, I mean, I would say that. We've just gained two provinces down here. We've not really expanded too much. But we could go to all these guys if we wanted to. Aragon defends them. Um, we could, yeah, this kind of benefits us to go more with them. I presume, though, that's probably breaking truces. Oh, no, actually, it's not. Oh, I know where this guy's died. Over here. Ah. I forgot I had an entire army here. We're in the money. Indeed we are. I'll go up there. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot all about you. Um, also, we now have an... Oh, we've got so much... Uh, thingy, but we had no way of coring them. Or... Not coring them, claiming them. That's the one. Um, convert all these, please. And then we are waiting on these ones, so I won't be spending any points. Um, and then I'm gonna go to war with maybe Provence. Maybe. Because Provence, actually, no, we wanna go to war with these guys. Where are you going? Stay in your lane, chum. Right, rise of these guys. Yep, okay, let's go. End it. Kill them all. We only probably need one army. And um, where's the other army that I've been building? So you're still going to be one short. Uh, one short. Um, let's build another one then. Spare no expenses. Excellent. Right. Perfect. Right. We're nearly done here. Right. Where's the capitals all over there. Let's go and take their capital. Then let's probably have a small war with Aragon. Can I just... No, I can't. Just walk into their land. Because France is going to be an idiot about it and just be like, no, you can't. And France looks awful anyway. Oh god, and it's got reform zealots and Protestant zealots going on. And I've just beaten their army up. No, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, France. They're a war with Provence. And Provence is looking big and they were wise to stay out of the war. It was a wise move. Oh, Nassau, and yep, yeah, that might end the, end the war, I'm not sure. Nope, here's our army, that will end the war, if we kill their army off. Oh, and my heirs has died, no! And then another heir died. We like went from two different heirs, because now we have a two-year-old. So there's an army somewhere that now has no general, because... <sighs> where is it? Where's the army that had no has no general now? It's down here in Egypt, which to be fair is not the end of the world. Um, let's just hire a general and hire a general. Because I don't care if I've had too much over leadership, because I have just amazing armies. Two good armies. Who needs better stuff? Oh! Excellent, right, let's just kill, let's take that fort, and then, I want to see how much they give me. Oh, they're both on low. They, mm. yeah, I'm not really wanting that, I kind of want some land. Oh well, we will kill them all then, I guess. Just keep killing, keep on killing. Ro for Rome, which is still not formed, but we're getting closer. Um, let's see, what do we need? We've taken Vienna, we could, we're nearly at Fez, we need all of France and Iberia, that's going to be fun to do. Um, so we'll have to have a war with France, certainly for like this half of France, then go into Iberia, take all that. Also, taking North Africa is a good stop-off point to get into Iberia. We're nearly there to be honest, it's probably going to take a couple more episodes. Um, and it'll help if we're not being stopped by goddamn uh, coalitions 
all the time, but we have to have a few of these wars. So we will... Uh, what do you want? No, you're not having just reparations. That's just a cowardly way of ending a war. I'm not doing that. Uh, Alright, end. That's perfect. Oh, what do you give me now? I want land. Give me your land. I just need la access to... You wouldn't even give me that? Wow. Well, I'm coming to deal with... Coming to deal with your Spanish allies now. Who might actually beat me because it's a three-star... I'm a bit worried now, actually. 16. 16. Oh, we'll see. Oh, it was never in doubt. It was never in doubt. <laughs> oh, gosh, this mod. I mean, I enjoy it, and... Um, but, I mean, I do at the same time, I think, God. This is a ridiculous campaign. I mean, I'm just wanting to complete the, make the empire in the quickest time possible, really. Um, okay, Tifalat or whatever it's called. Let's go take that. We might need to kill this army off again, actually. Go in here, kill them. Here we go. Lovely. No, I'm still not just giving you nothing. This is going to be for all your land. Oh, did I just... I didn't just stack quite that army. No. About to now, though. Yep, there it goes. That entire army. Wow. Gone. Excellent. Right. Now, let's... I imagine both, the, both uh, factions are both quite happy to end the war now. No, that'll be it. Um, that's kind of fine. Yeah, I'm kind of fine with that. Just take all that land. Now North Africa looks a bit more defend. Well, not defended, but there's some irrelevant bits of the world that they can now defend with forts. We can put some forts over here. Actually, we've already got one. And now I can. I've got an access to Fez, which is what I wanted to have access to, so I can claim it. I want to fabricate a claim on Fez. I to fabricate a claim on here. Fabricate a claim on nowhere else. Damn it. Excellent, though. We're nearly there. Now we've got Fez next on the line. Um, we'll sort that out in the next episode. We'll probably also go to war with France and Aragon as well. The Priscilla still rules strong at the age of 54. She's going with Hel Helen the first. She's doing well. She's also now got her grandson on the throne instead of whoever else was supposed to be on the throne. Uh, let's just do that. Metallurgy. And so we've got mills. Excellent. So um, we will pause there. I would just like to say thank you very much, guys, for watching the video. If you've enjoyed, please leave a like and subscribe. Until next time, I will see you guys later.